Hi friends. So earlier we read a story called The Tiny Seed. Do you remember what happened in that story? Um, it started out with some seeds in the beginning and remember those seeds floated away onto the wind for a while and then they finally landed and some of the seeds grew into plants and then into flowers, right? And then at the end of the book, the big giant flower had the seed pod in the middle and that broke open and those seeds flew out again and it started all over again. So that is something called a life cycle. That was the life cycle of a flower. So today I thought we could talk about that. I have a picture here to kind of show you the life cycle of a sunflower. So it starts out here, there's some seeds, right? And those seeds, after they land on the ground, they land in a good spot and they have some sunlight and some water, they'll start to grow a root. The root grows first down into the ground. And then if it keeps growing, its roots will grow and it'll start to grow a stem and some leaves. And then it keeps going, getting sunlight and water and it grows into a baby plant. That plant then will keep growing into a, like a kid plant, right? And then it'll be an adult plant. And remember what's in the middle from our story? It's called a seed pod. And when it turns into the fall or autumn time, that will start to come apart a little bit and the seeds will come out and they'll start all over again for another life cycle. So I thought maybe together today we could draw a picture of a life cycle of a flower. So will you join me? Grab a piece of paper, maybe a marker. Um, now, I've never really done this before, so I was going to just try, right? Because that's how we learn. We try new things and we just try and we try our best. So do that with me, okay? You can use whatever colors you want. Um, we really just want to talk about what happens in the life cycle. So whatever colors you want to use are fine. So I'm going to start. Ooh, and here I wanted to show you, I have some sunflower seeds here. I like to grow sunflowers at my house. And I have some seeds here to show you. They're just kind of little brown things. Different sunflowers have different kinds of seeds, but these are the sunflower seeds I have. So that's what I'm going to try to draw. Uh, let's see, they're just kind of little brown spots. So I'm going to draw some little brown spots. You could draw them whatever color you want to though. All right, so there's my seeds. Do you remember what happens after they are seeds? If they find a good place to land, where there's maybe some dirt and there's sunlight and water, the seed will start to grow roots down into the ground, right? There's my roots. Are you drawing some seeds and some roots too? All right, so after the seeds grow, draw another little arrow if you want to. And then we still have the seed and it has the roots and then it grows up toward the sun with a stem and some leaves. So we have our sprout that is called a sprout. All right, and then moving on, our sprout turns into, here's my roots, my sprout is gonna turn into a baby plant. So my stem gets a little bit bigger, get a little more leaves on there. There's my baby plant. And then I'm gonna move on, still going around in our circle. After a baby plant, then it grows more and it turns into a kid plant, right? Kind of like you guys are kids, it's a kid plant. So here's my stem and my leaves. I decided to change colors and that's okay. And even maybe it's starting to grow a flower. Hard to see a little bit. My markers aren't working great, but I'm doing my best, right? And then my kid plant turns into a grown-up plant, right? An adult plant. It still has roots down in the earth that helps it get what it needs from the earth. And it still has its big stem, lots of leaves now, and maybe it has a big flower up on top. Big flower. And in the middle of our big flower, is that thing, do you remember what that's called? A seed pod in the middle. And what comes out of the seed pod? The seeds, right? And then it starts all over again. It's a cycle. So that is a, is a plant life cycle.
I hope you draw, drew it with me. Maybe you could take a picture of your drawing and send it to me if you want to. All right, guys, keep up the good work. Maybe when you, if you are able to go outside today, you could look around for some plants that are starting to grow and see if you can figure out what part of the life cycle they're in. Maybe it's a little, probably in the springtime, it's just maybe a little sprout, maybe a baby plant. So take a look around and see what you see. All right, bye.